So, if you have two-step verification on and you try to use Final Cut Pro, you will not be able to put an account in and actually verify it. So, that's one of the issues that uh, you may have found. So, to do that, you're going to just make sure that to go under two-step verification, you need to turn it off, then add an account in Final Cut Pro 10, all right? So visit authorizing applications in site. You can see all the applications that I have. You can revoke access, ScreenFlow, Wirecast, Adobe, Visio. So you can actually ha and add application specific passwords when I sign up. So if I wanted to have an application specific password, you could do that. But what I found, I found that it's easy to just grant two-step verification, especially if you use a Final Cut Pro because ScreenFlow has a thing that lets you have, have two-step verification. But Final Cut Pro will just give you an error. You won't know what the error is. And I was sitting here wondering why I couldn't load my YouTube video you, uh, to my Web Video Chef's account. All right. And uh, and this is a test video, by the way. I don't shoot vertical videos, just sidebar. <laughs> a trading video. So you want to make sure you turn off two-step verification. And you're going to go to your Google account. And then once you go to your Google account, you'll be able to set up or turn off two-step verification. I'm not going to start it because you'll see all the information there. But I just wanted to share that with you for those who have trouble trying to click here and add an account like I did and I'm just going to add a destination and it's going to be YouTube I'm going to um, put it right there and then I'm just going to type my web video chefs email and then because I was adding it I was going to keychain I was going all that stuff and see it's verified now when I had two-step verification it was not verified and didn't work. So that's a quick tip for you. Thanks a lot.